So, you're here because you want to make your downloads faster. Well, not only fast, but of course, 10 times faster than your regular internet speed. I got you. Stick around, I'll show you how. Very earthy being. What is up people of Earth? Welcome to the most earthy channel here on YouTube. You are watching Very Earthly Being. Today, you've seen the intro, you've seen the title, and you've seen the thumbnail. Yep, our content for today is how to make your downloads 10 times faster on PC. This works for Mac too, and it works the same as the process in Windows computers, okay? So you don't need to worry about downloading devices, okay? So of course, this software is also available for Android. So if you want me to make a tutorial about Android, including this software, please comment down below, Android tutorials, Android tutorials. Android tutorial. Anyways, so let's hop on to our desktop. So guys, welcome to my desktop right now. And as you can see, I am going to screen record to show you the process and procedures on how to install and use free download manager. Yes, that is the name of the software that we are going to download. So now go to your preferred browser. My preferred browser is Google Chrome. It is the best browser for me, for my opinion. But if you have Opera GX, Opera or Firefox or Safari, you can use that too. This link will be safe. It will be in the description too. So check it out. Let's go. Now you just want to go to your Google Chrome and type in free download manager so we can start our um, procedures manager so we have it right here free download manager now as you can see it's marked violet because i've been here a couple of times now and if you see right here, here's the direct download link for the free download manager so what are you waiting for just click on it and if it doesn't show up you can go to this link right here but it's more time saving if you can click this link as soon as possible but anyways as you can see mac os android and windows of course all of these are gonna be available for your device so now let's go to the download tab and it will load for a bit and as you can see we have the free download right here 64 bit for windows 10 8.1 8 and 7 i just saw this linux is compatible all right this software is compatible with linux devices i'm so sorry for the miscommunication earlier but anyways if you use mac os if you use linux if you are using android as of now you can download it it is very safe and it's not that large on your device so now let's download it but i am using 64 bit so i'm just gonna click on this but if you're using 32 bit you can click the thing right here the link down here so it can direct you to the download of the 32 bit so if you don't know what bit your computer is don't worry just go to your settings in the um, start menu go to settings right here go to system right here and now as you can see just go down scroll down right here about go to the about section and as you can see 64 bit operating system that's why i'm going to click on the 64 bit it will show up x86 32 bit right here if you are using a 32 bit currently so now i'm just gonna download this one and as you can see it is starting to download right here very fast so there's times that it's not gonna be fast unexpectedly on your internet connection FDM or free download manager will save your day now just click on the download right here at the bottom and it will prompt you something for the installation I only have one device so let's just install for me only so now let's go next Okay, so if you agree on both of these terms, create a desktop shortcut. Yes, I agree on that. Create a quick launch shortcut. I also agree on that. Just click next. And you have some of the uh, informations and like directories that it will install. So let's click on install after that. It will take a few seconds, so let's just wait. So 
after that you will be directed to the web browser that you have just downloaded um, it will pop up on a Google Chrome in your Windows device or if you're using a Mac it will work the same thing the procedures will be done the same way it is used in Windows and it will prompt you maybe in Safari or something but if you have Google Chrome maybe it would open up in Google Chrome so it would prompt something up as you can see in the taskbar just click on that just finish it and now it's all done just close your web browser after you close your web browser as you can see like the instructions earlier it will create a desktop shortcut for me i checked that out and now it's all here now let's just click on free download manager and now it's open the panel is now appearing and would you like to make fdm as the default torrent client i don't do that because sometimes it's pretty annoying to see that you want to download some stuff and then free download manager will open up as soon as possible and you know i sometimes want to download it directly from the web browser and not going to other applications now if you don't want to do that just don't ask again or there's a little x right here let's just click don't ask again just to be sure now download list is empty add a new download url i'm gonna show you something cool right now okay so i'm gonna go to a website to download something and let's see how fast FDM or free download manager responds so now I opened a tab called itch.io it's an indie game stores where the indie developers of these games can upload it here let's just pick a random game uh, let's see let's try a hundred megabytes or more than a hundred megabytes would be cool so let's have hmm so let's just download one of the games I played in this channel. The link is up here. Check it out. All right. So now it's called Paranormal Entities. Let's grab that in. Paranormal Entities. 255 MB. Okay, that's cool. So first up, I'm going to get my alarms and timers just to keep track on how much time it's spending when you download it in the website itself all right so let's just get our timer right here so the stopwatch is in our screen right now let's click on download no thanks just take me to the downloads uh okay so let's just download this 255 mb okay so just pause this right now um 4.5 mb let's just show all now let's pop the timer up right here at the side and let's see how long this takes me all right If some of you viewers that has a poo poo connection, this means free download manager is pretty much for you because it can be used for Mac, Windows, Linux, Android. It's all in one. Okay, three seconds left, one second left, zero seconds left. Zero seconds left, but it's still going. Are you kidding me? Two minutes on the clock. And let's stop it right there. 2 minutes and 17 seconds just to be downloaded. Let's delete it from our downloads folder. The thing here is you need to get the link and then paste it onto free download manager. Alright, so just get this link. Right click on the link down there. Down the title of the file you're downloading. So now just get the link. Copy link the address. There we go minimize everything restart this just minimize it and now let's go to free download manager let's close our file explorer for a second let's close it and now paste our file in here so you don't want to right click because it won't do stuff when you right click and paste it you have to press ctrl v ctrl plus v or in mac command plus v all right 
control V and as you can see enter and now as you can see right here every single detail is in okay now just want to hit download okay okay we're on it we're on it look at that 15 16 20 plus percent on 10 seconds are you kidding me right now nope wow this is amazing this is why you should get free download manager i recommend you getting this as soon as possible not sponsored but if you want to sponsor me go <laughs> look at that 217 mb what time is it 55 seconds almost one minute can he beat the clock nope and oh stop one minute and 12 seconds i have proven the worth of free download manager let's close the timer right here let's close fdm or free download manager let's close google chrome and i'm gonna show you that it wasn't even compressed or connected to a vpn it automatically does it for you all right so now let's go to our downloads folder um go to of course right here paranormal entities like the game we downloaded it took only one minute to extract it so you can see that it wasn't even compressed a single bit processing every file in the zip file just a reminder it works with every file either exe it wouldn't change the directory either like iso files or jpeg files png files any files you need to download from the web it's completely fine and safe and will be the original one not compressed when you use fdm or free download manager so as you can see let's open up the folder it's all right there refresh it just to see yep it's still there so what are we waiting for download free download manager right now so guys if you enjoyed today's video please smash that like button subscribe right now share this with your friends and most importantly hit notification so you'll be updated every time i'll post a new video that concludes our video for today i'll see you next time goodbye How many downloads did I even say in this video?